Can everyone stand up, raise your drinks? Cheers to the bride, now smoke it on, she looks. Jake. Take a second, have a look around at the family and friends gathered here today, whether we've come up the hill from Tauranga or across the Tasman and beyond. We're all here to help you celebrate one of life's greatest moments. Jess, it is an honour to finally call you my wife. You have gifted me with a beautiful daughter, guided me to be a good father. Help me see strength within myself when I've needed it most. Overall, you help me be the best version of myself. So for that, Jess, thank you. Four years ago was one of the best years of my life. When 24-year-old me met 31-year-old Jake, I bought a yacht and on team. <laughs> After doing a bit of investigation, thanks to my dad, giving me some good skills, I was in luck. Jake was freshly single and ready to mingle. I was determined to win Jake over and decided the crew Christmas party with plenty of drinks involved would be the perfect setting. Knowing that the boys and girls would be partnering up, I positioned myself next to Jake during the instruction briefing. When the moment arrived, Jake casually said to me, should we go together? I replied, oh yeah, sounds good. We raced around Antigua, stopping at beaches, breaking down and laughing endlessly. It was definitely a spark in the air. It was a tiring day, but of course, as great Kiwis and Aussies do, Jake and I decided to enjoy the Antigua light life. After a few boogies and a few more drinks later, we headed home to the boat. I was very happy with myself with how smooth my whole plan had gone. <laughs> And I got, I got in some great quality time. <laughs> anyway, next minute, my dreams came true. <laughs> I was walking down the corridor of the boat. Jake pulled my shoulder, turned me around and gave me a big old sloppy kiss. <laughs> Honestly, I can still remember that kiss today. And from that day, the rest has been history. Oh.